Alright, so welcome back. Hoping all of you guys are having a fabulous day here today. We do got some pretty fun stuff to talk about that I kind of wanted to sort of go into now that I've made my already what to expect video of the season. I wanted to see what you guys wanted basically. Saying like, hey, what do you want to see? What fixes? What um, updates? What things to be added in the season? And I got a pretty decent amount of replies here, so I thought I'd jump into the video now. Um, again, let me know down below what you want to see in the, in the uh, from the community, right? In the newest update uh, from the devs. Hopefully, they cook up here. Whatever this game is, it has the highest potential. It's just they are slow. We're going to have to be okay with that at a, at a point if you want to stick with the game. Uh, that, is a, that is a fact. It's a, it's a truth of the century. In order to play this game properly, you have to be okay with their slow update cycle and buff cycle, nerf cycle, fix cycle. That's just how it is. And uh, for what this game is, I definitely think that they're dropping the ball here because per per update you see how many players come back to the game it's like if they were to speed things up or expand maybe the studio definitely this game could be uh pretty much more than what it is as a niche game so that's just my opinion but we'll see right so let's jump into it if you're new to the channel like and subscribe help us out a ton let's check it out together and let's talk about everything yeah first things first i asked the question on my uh community feed tab a little bit ago it's this one on screen i also have some gameplay in the back so you can enjoy that um and then i'll just like take the pictures and put it on yeah we'll do this in a good editing way but first things first do we need the premium login back in the game why did i ask this question if anybody was wondering why uh, there was a few comments saying why are you asking that it's like a common question or an easy answer and the end the question or answer to your question is i asked this because randomly over the course of the last three weeks i've seen a large influx of comments saying that the premium me bringing out the premium login is gonna ruin the community um or ruin the game because i'm reminding players that this system exists when I shouldn't be doing that because we don't need the premium login back and that's what the game is failing because the players uh, can't have all these summons and that's what the game is failing because they're not making enough money because players have too many summons to summon. Whoever thinks that is actually moronic. I hope you know that. And if you do think that, not say that you are moronic, but think about something else because you might not be the smartest. Remember, how this game operates is this. You pay money, you get tickets. You play, you get measly amount of tickets right a very small amount you're not getting like a big massive amount of tickets right remember theoretically when we did our math it was around three to four months to fully pity a character and um that's a very long time in now a cycle in one uh, season right they're re releasing you two character uh two skill kits one character correct so in the course of 60 days right theoretically you're not getting any of those because you can't pity those remember that it takes three to four months the your original system was dog crap it, it was, but it was tolerable because the premium login exists. And it's like, yeah, at, at a point, maybe here and there I win on a banner, so it's okay. But now they're speeding up the cycle and they're removing the login. It's bad. So we need the login. Thank you to 93% of my community having brain cells here. 6% you still have brain cells. You're fine. People just play the game to have fun with the game. To a degree, they're going to be fine. If they can just pull the characters here and there, if they like a really, uh, character like a lot, then it's cool. But the 1%, it's 100 percent the dev team <laughs> there's no way it's not dude there's no way you're saying that it's not good or it doesn't need to be there but next i asked this what do you think that really needs to be fixed and added uh in this update i'm really curious in my opinion they have to take care of the concerns of the community right like they really need to fix the issues correct compress is still bugged ibarra is still bugged um twice isn't bugged correct he just has some issues here and there i'm not going to call them issues anymore because other characters have much worse issues. But um, that's there. There also is a bug with, I think, Ashigaraki, if I didn't already mention that. Uh, he has a lot of issues, too. So a lot of characters bug. Please fix the bugs. Like, it's so stupid that it takes this long to get bug fixes. But that's there. So hopefully those things get ironed out. Uh, Switch players are still encountering the compressed bug. So uh, how about we help them out? You know what I mean? Uh, next up, comment over here. So we have a bunch of comments. Again, I'm going to just try to pick as many as I possibly can. First one, premium login. Solos became uh, or becomes a permanent playlist. Fix a aura. Increase the incentive for normal players to keep playing the game. And count quirk skill sets as characters so the character tickets become useful. Every point in this one is god tier. The only point that I'm going to talk about really is the solos one being a little bit more of an issue. Um, in solos, again, I don't know if I experienced this, if everyone experienced this. Uh, teaming is absolutely insanity correct um in that in that playlist i've never encountered more uh like teamers than any other thing dude solos was just plagued with teamers it would be a trio four players five players it was consistently let's say this it was always a trio teaming correct like a normal trio instead of queuing into trios they're gonna uh, queue into solos because the player pool is so low that at nighttime at middle of the day whenever and even in the normal morning time right it's just so easy to queue in these matches because uh, it's again a small player pool 
it was just teeming upon teeming. In my solos videos, everyone was commenting like, dude, why well, wasn't that Kirishima fighting that Dabi, right? Because it's like at those points, we saw like literally on my video, they were just teaming. They weren't fighting each other. They were either trying to fight the whole lobby and their goal was to kill the whole lobby, then fight each other. It was super annoying. So I hope that, again, I don't think it's a fix they can really take care of. Hence why they didn't bring solos back too quickly. It's because they know too, the player pool is too small and it's just teaming uh, constantly happens. Because again, you can't fix that, right? You're going to ban those players, but there's always going to be somebody that will do it again. And uh, if you keep banning those players, <laughs> you're going to kill the player pool more. So who knows, right? Who knows? But again, it's, it's a great mode. I think solos should be here. Solos, you don't have to rely on a teammate. It's so good. It's such a good mode. But I hope they can tackle something with that aspect and kind of fix the teaming thing, right? In Fortnite, it's a little bit harder because the player pool is much larger. And queuing in here and there is not the easiest thing to do. But on this game, it's so easy to team. It's not even funny. Um, Mr. Compress and Shigaraki fixed that. 100%, I agree. Um, we have... Make all the characters that release in Season 4 have zero issues. It's getting old, getting a bugged character every launch, uh, which is true, correct? Um, flawless is a rough one, so we're not going to get really a flawless character. But uh, Twice was cool. Whatever he was, he wasn't too bugged. He had a very annoying issue. <laughs> turn, a turn a Todoroki into uh, your bot, and he'll damage you. I was mortified, bro. That, that happened too often. And then Bakugo, too. If you do it to Bakugo, uh, he would, like, hollow or impact into you and bash you through a wall because, you know, that's how the game is. So, very annoying stuff, but, yeah, I, I do agree um, on that one. Uh, Toga and Kaminari need to catch some uh, nerfs. They uh, also need to fix the Ida Infinite Gamma glitch. Also, I hope they are... Uh, I hope they don't re-nerf twice. He's perfect, as I've heard uh, people complaining about his alpha. Um, I don't want to be biased, so I'm not going to bring him the twice situation again. So we're going to move on there. Toga and Kaminari, again, not going to be biased there. But I do think the Kaminari needs to get fixed because it's bad when you have like a full perfect match going for you. And again, human stun gun pulls up and just destroys your whole game, right? To a degree, you shouldn't have a 100-0 combo. It's, it's a very dog crap thing. And uh, whatever Kaminari is, I've tried him. I played as a, as a character. Uh, he is not a hard character to master. I'm going to be honest. I get it. I am not the best at him, nor will I say I'm top tier, correct? But I will say the amount of people's days I've ruined with that character within my uh, hour of playing him, correct? Because again, I don't play uh, Dinky like that. But for that video, I played him and um, I one shot like three, four, five players in one video. So it's, it's a bit much. Definitely needs to uh, rework that. But it should be stun him. You can half his HP, but nothing more than that, right? It's, it's a very problematic thing. And it gets to the point where it's like, once a Kaminari destroys a player from 100 and 0, that player's quitting the game most of the time, right? Because it's like, I what the fudge? I had such a good match going for me. It's it's really going to ruin the game. And it's it's happening very often where I see players quitting in my comment section because of Kaminari. So, depends on what you want to say, but I can say from an outside perspective, everyone comes to my videos to tell me, Gogo, I'm quitting the game because of Denki. And that's literally the fact. So, this one over here, premium login, uh, damage from finishes, Nerf Denki, nerf Red Deku. Red Deku, really? Damn, I've seen people. <laughs> I've seen people call him mid. Nerf Red Deku, but yeah, maybe. Fix a bar, nerf uh, Toga. So fix a bar, I agree with. Nerf Toga to a degree, just makes Stabby Stab a little less longer. Uh, it's a little annoying how long the thing lasts when you're in Plus Ultra and other stuff. So yeah, that's the only real take I have on that one. Like it's fine to have her have two betas, but those betas last too way, way too long when you hit a player. It lasts way too long. More crystal opportunities, like 500,000 gold or, uh, for maybe 10,000 crystal, uh, crystals, uh, since gold is pretty much useless. I Literally, 10 out of 10 common right there. I've been begging to make gold and other currencies useful, but, you know, here, we're, here, here we are. Um, <laughs> here we are. Here. Uh, we have, this, is a good, this is a good comment, too. Uh, here's what I want for Season 4, slash need to address, uh, slash add. Uh, nerf Danky stun, slash Toga beta damage. Okay. Need a permanent solo mode, 10 out of 10. Hopefully fix the rental ticket, 10 out of 10. They have to fix that rental ticket. Please, devs, if you're watching this, do nothing in this update but fix the rental ticket and bring back your login. Those two things have to happen. Um, I keep getting comments that complained on my original Twice video where it's like, dude, I, I loaded into a, a match, right? And I died. Or, like, I died off one. Or I lagged out. Or my game crashed. Now what? Now I have to wait 24 hours to play this twice again? Moronic, right? That or become Toga and copy him. Like, it, it's so stupid what you have to do to play as a character. What's wrong with three tickets? I'm so lost on why that was an issue. And everyone's going to say like, oh, day one is bad. Who cares? It's one day. Next day, you'll be fine. You know what I mean? Let them rent it. Um, so they at least have a chance to play as a character. But, uh, or maybe at least, like, I don't know. There's so many fixes, but it's sad where it goes to. Um, get rid of bot lobbies in ranked mode. Probably won't happen, but in a future. I would have wanted it in a future update. 
Um, I heard a lot of exploits go because of that, so yeah. For PC, IP banned players who are using third-party cheats, they they put a um, anti-cheat and the game still has just, it's riddled with cheaters on PC. I keep hearing about that. After dealing with the cheaters on PC, add crossplay. Um, if they add crossplay, probably, if they don't allow a feature to um, like turn crossplay off, probably I will end up quitting the game. Because, dude, I, because I try PC in there, like, for, for like, some of the, the homies. I try to, like, run with them uh, because they keep asking me to. And we, we run into too many cheaters. Like, we, we can't have fun anymore. It's, like, always an all mine cheating. I don't know why. It's, why is it always all mine? And he just goes plus ultra 10,000 times. It's very annoying. And then, last but not least, cross progression. But if they add cross play, but they don't remove the ability to turn it off, I'm most likely quitting, bro. <laughs> I'm not dealing with that. Every video I'm going to try to, like, record, and I'm going to have to just deal with a cheater every time um it's it's very annoying right again it's just it's just it's too much but i hope we get crossplay i'm not saying that i hope we get it it's just they have to make sure that cheating and all that stuff is handled which it won't be so at least allow console players to have the decision right so many games Im implement that call of duty i think fortnite too so many games implement the ability to turn off crossplay um to allow you to at least stay with your own players and on console you stay away from the cheaters right so again there's that and again pc players complain about console players they're going to continuously complain then, oh, he has aimbot because he has a little bit of aim assist, right? Which, it's always going to happen, so. To ignore that entire aspect, just turn off crossplay and you're good. <laughs> you know what I mean? Very easy uh, situation fix there, but. Yeah. Again, there's this. I'm going to just copy and paste these three together because there are very good comments. They're all there. Add a counterplay to Denki's one-shot ability. Uh, Kaminari human stun gun. It's the new hitbox, basically, of Todoroki. Get stronger anti-cheat. I ran into a double all might. Oh, see? Look at that. With no cooldowns on their skill. Same. I managed to kill one, though, so they're uh, <laughs> they were still bad at the game. I've downed a cheater before, and they go plus ultra. I don't know how, but they're, like, down on the ground. And before I can finish them, they just go plus ultra. So it's a very annoying thing that I keep encountering. Um, another one over here, Uraka needs a buff. Wow, didn't hear that one in a while. Uh, I heard she's bad right now, but that's crazy. Premium login, crossplay, and a new game mode. <sighs> yeah, a new game mode is what we need, bro. We definitely need it. Fix Abara. I would like to play uh, in Season 4 as Lemillion. Could you imagine Lemillion, dude? Um, as a purple color? Wouldn't wouldn't Lemillion be like agility, dude? Isn't he like super fast moving? Could be could be purple though. I don't know. Uh, Primo login, please. Uh, if they keep this up, I'm gonna stop playing. Primo login, and yeah, there's a lot more. Sugar Rocky grab. I'm not gonna screenshot these, but cross play, add cross progression. Uh, quirk rental tickets. Cook, yo, Saul, uh, Saul Goodman, cook it out here. Yeah, yeah, we need quirk rental tickets, but Nerf Kaminari, uh, way too much, bro. We need way too much. Homie's cooking. And then a lot more crossplay, but those are most of the comments I was, uh, that I have right now on this entire poll uh, or post, rather. Um, a lot of them are just saying premium login and asking for characters that we don't have yet. But again, where it stands is uh, I definitely think that the game still cooks. For what it is, they cook. It's just they have to keep cooking. They 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 cook and then they let it burn, right? They let it sit there on, on the stove. It just it just starts charring, burning, dying, and then they recook, right? They they, they dump it out, recook, and then burn it again. It's like. Keep cooking. <laughs> Don't stop cooking. But, uh, yeah, it's like they have to do a lot of fixes and stuff here. But, I mean, um, yeah, I don't know. I've been having fun lately. I haven't complained a little bit. I've just been asking for a premium login. So, I do think that this season they might fix things and make things work. But this wasn't as worse as the Endeavor season. Endeavor was the worst season. That had the mo that was riddled with bugs, bro. I wanted to jump out a window with that game. With that, the game then I wanted to jump out a window. Here, I tolerate it much more than that, dude. Maybe my threshold threshold is just out the window. But, dude, that was bad. <laughs> this is much better. So, hoping season four is a good season. But we shall see. We shall see. All right? Take care.